Here we go. Jim uh, in five W Q M asks, have a super code plug, but have also created a couple of local code plugs. How do I combine them to radio? Uh, yeah, great question. So we actually have a video that covers this as well. Uh, but if you have multiple code plugs and you want to combine them into one, once again, it's going to be just like uh, we talked about with exporting. I'll show you real quick. We'll, we'll cover this since a few questions have involved it. Uh, let's jump over here into the computer if we have it. There we go. We'll, we'll show you how this would work. Uh, so on the computer, let's open up the CPS here. Here we go. So I have a code plug in my CPS. Let's say this is on my radio. So I want to combine that with a different code plug or make some other changes like remove you know, this line here. Let's see if we can delete that. Doesn't look like we can delete a blank line. So we'd have to do that outside the CPS. So what you'll do is go up to Tool and then go to Export. Uh, now depending on what information you want to change, you may export the whole thing or just part of it. In this case, I'm just going to do the channel and we'll just put that on the desktop. Oops. Okay. Okay, so we'll export that as a CSV file and just click export. That'll take a minute to export everything. Export complete. So let's go have a look at our desktop. There it is. Oops. So now if we open this up in Excel, Just go ahead and open that up. And like I said, if you don't have Excel, you can use just about any other numbers processor. Uh, there's a variety of options out there. Okay. There we go. Okay, so we have it open here. Uh, so at this point, we can make all the changes we want to it. So this column here on the left, that's your number. That's where it's going to show up in your list. Um, so like if you wanted to theoretically get rid of of those blank lines, you can change those numbers uh, to make them all correspond correctly. Now, theoretically, that can mess up your zones, so just be aware of that. You may have to rebuild your zones if you do that, uh, but you can certainly do so. And if you wanted to combine a code plug, what you'll do is uh, open both of them up into this format. So you'll go back in your CPS, read from your other radio, or open your other code plug that you got from a friend, for example, export it, and then what you'll do is basically whatever section of that other code plug or the whole thing you want to copy, you'll just take this, let's say I want to copy this section right here, just get all that information, there we go, hold down shift, oops, I think that worked there, there we go, so now we have all of that information and just do a control C or you can go up to file and copy that way and what we'll do is actually go paste that in our new code plug, so what we could do is just control C. Now I can go down here and we'll pretend this is a new code plug now. Um, what you'll do is actually come down to this section and paste all of that information into your new code plug. Uh, and, and then you basically just save this, make sure you save it as a, a CSV. And then once you do, you'll go back to your CPS, go to that same tool, and this time you're going to import and import the channel list or whatever other information you modified. And uh, at, you, at that point, most likely you'll have to rebuild some of your zones if you're combining things uh, just because of how the channel numbers add up. Uh, you can take care of that outside, but it'll be easier just to rebuild them. And at that point, you're all set. Uh, so that's the easiest way to, to rebuild a code plug uh, or in this case, uh, transfer like two code plugs, merge them together. Hopefully that answers your question.